Nogwe Ach Jeridach. Hello and welcome to the Nogama Village Mi'kmaq language program. This lesson looks at opposites dealing with good and bad. There are times when these opposites will be easy to spot and other times will be more challenging. We will start off easy using words that begin with willy, which means good, and winny, which means bad. The way I remember this is Willie is a good boy and Winnie is a bad girl. Now, let's start practicing. Our first example is Wiltek, which can mean it is nice or it is pretty. It can also mean that it is nicely shaped or is situated in the correct spot and refers to an inanimate object. Repeat after me. Wiltek, it is nice. Wiltek, Wiltek. It is nice. Well, Deck. Well, Deck. It is nice. Well, Deck. Well, Deck. Well, Deck. The opposite of Well, Deck is Wind Deck. It is not nice or it is not pretty. Say it with me. Wind Deck. It is not nice. Wind Deck. Wind Deck. It is not nice. Wind deck. Wind deck. It is not nice. Wind deck. Wind deck. Our next pair deals with sounds such as music and how appealing they are. If you like a song that is playing, you might say, Wildach. It sounds nice. Wildach. Wildach. It sounds nice. Wildach. Well, dach. It sounds nice. Perhaps you don't like that song. In that case, you would say, Windach. It does not sound nice, or it sounds bad. Windach. Windach. It sounds bad. Windach. Windach. It sounds bad. Notice how, in both of these first sets of examples, the final I was dropped. You will encounter this again with other words, so keep an eye out for it. Next, let's consider a common topic of conversation, the weather. Often, when we meet someone, we will mention if the weather is good or bad. In Mi'kmaq, on a good day, we'll say, Wiligiskik, it's a nice day. Practice with me. Wiligiskik, it's a nice day. Willy Giskik. Willy Giskik. It's a nice day. Willy Giskik. Willy Giskik. It's a nice day. Willy Giskik. Willy Giskik. Willy Giskik. The weather isn't always nice, however. And on those bad days, we would say, Winnie Giskik. Repeat after me. Winigiskik. It's not a nice day. Winigiskik. Winigiskik. It is not a nice day. Winigiskik. Winigiskik. It is not a nice day. Winigiskik. 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 If you are out at night, you might say to someone, Willy Wallag, it's a nice night. Let's try it. Willy Wallag. Willy Wallag. It's a nice night. Willy Wallag. Willy Wallag. It's a nice night. Willy Wallag. Willy Wallag. And if the weather is bad that night, Winnie will agua. It's a bad night. Winnie will agua. Winnie will agua. It's a bad night. Winnie will agua. Winnie will agua. It's a bad night. Winnie will agua. Winnie will agua. Our sense of smell is one of the most immediate and powerful of all the senses. 
but not all smells are good. And so, to indicate whether we like the scent of something or not, we would say, Willy mach, it smells nice. Willy mach, Willy mach, it smells nice. Willy mach, Willy mach, it smells nice. Willy mach. Willy mach. The opposite of this would be Winnie mach. Winnie mach, it smells bad. Winnie mach. Winnie mach, it smells bad. Winnie mach. Winnie mach. Willie cinnamon. Hey, Willie mach. Oh, how we would. Mmm, what's the way? Well, it's cinnamon. Oh, Winnie mach. Go away, wood. Well, it means it has a nice shape, but it can refer to a person's body or appearance. Willy get. He or she has a nice shape. Willy get. Willy get. He or she has a nice shape. Willy get. Willy get. He or she has a nice shape. Well again. Well again. However, if a person is not in great shape, you might hear someone say, Winnie get. He or she is in bad shape. Winnie get. Winnie get. He or she is in bad shape. Winnie get. Winnie get. He or she is in bad shape. Winnie get. Winnie get. Winnie get. Rather than talking about other people, however, maybe you want to say something about yourself. Well, a muxi, I look good or I look healthy. Practice with me. Well, a muxi. Well, a muxi, I look healthy. Well, a muxi. Well, a muxi, I look healthy. Okay. If you are not pleased with how you appear, however, you might say, Mu will amuks you. I don't look good. And this refers to illness. Mu will amuks you. I don't look good. Mu will amuks you. Mu will amuks you. I don't look good. Mu will amuks you. Mu will amuks you. I don't look good. Notice how we did not say Willamuxi, but instead said Mu Willamuxiu. This is because Winamuxi has a different meaning. It means I am dirty looking or unkempt. Try it with me. Winamuxi, I am unkempt. Winamuxi, Winamuxi, I am unkempt. Winamuxi. Winamuxi, I am unkempt. Like all things, no person is perfect. So here too, we have a pair of opposites that we can apply to a person. If you believe a person is good, you might refer to him or her by saying, Wilma Doxip, he or she is a good person. Wilma Doxit, Wilma Doxit, he or she is a good person. Wilma Doxit. Well, Madoxit, he or she is a good person. If they are a bad person, you would say, Mu will Madoxip. He or she is a bad person. Mu will Madoxip. Mu will Madoxit. He or she is a bad person. Mu will Madoxit. Mu will Madoxit. 
he or she is a bad person. In other videos, we will get into how to apply verbs to a specific person or a group of people. For now, however, we will take two examples of having a nice shape and looking good and apply it to a single person that we are speaking with. In this case, we are saying you are looking good and have a nice shape. So we would say Willemuxin ach Willigen. Repeat after me. Willemuxin ach Willigen. Willemuxin ach Willigen. You are looking good and have a nice shape. Willemuxin ach Willigen. Willemuxin ach Willigen. You are looking good and have a nice shape. Can you figure out how to say the opposite of this? Keep practicing, and I'm sure you will. Kesiawi, onnui soltenage, velalioch ach nomotoksepu.